Hey, what's going on? Welcome to the channel. My name is The Real Legend, and we are back with some NBA 2K Mobile. As you can see, there's a brand new loading screen to kick off the All-Star 2021 theme. Now, I hope you watched the game last night. Damian Lillard and Steph Curry were cooking. They were both on fire. Incredible highlights from the both of them. And Giannis was doing his thing as well. All right, so now let's go into the brand new theme. We're going to talk about the players that were added. Uh, if you watch my last video, I did reveal all the players that will be included in this theme already. But we're going to go over the rarities, how to craft these players. There's a few new things being introduced in the catalog along with the collection. Some of the players got stat upgrades. And we're going to go over the official announcement from NBA 2K Mobile where they break down the next upcoming events, the rewards that will be available, and also some information for the brand new set, which is including one of the greatest players of all time. Pretty fire, all right? So let's get into this video. All right, so this is a jam-packed theme. 24 players included. So the first player is gonna be Emeril Nikola Vucevic. He has a theme loyalty ability, so if we pair him up with two other cards from this theme, he will get a power increase. Then we got Jalen Brown, who has the duo ability. So if you pair him up with Jason Tatum, he will get an increase. He can be crafted with one collectible, 10 Emerald Rings, and the Eastern Conference collectibles. Then we got Zach Levine, who can be crafted with two collectibles. He has a team loyalty bonus, which you pair him up with two other Chicago Bulls. He'll get a theme loyalty bonus. So if you pair him up with Derrick Rose, the Chicago Bull version, and a Scottie Pippen, you should be okay. Or even a Dennis Rodman with the Bulls. Then we got Rudy Gobert, dual ability. So if we pair him up with Donovan Mitchell, he will get a power increase. We got Donovan Mitchell, we've just mentioned, has that dual ability which you pair with Rudy Gobert. We got a Zion Williamson Sapphire. He has team loyalty bonus. So if you pair him up with Lonzo Ball and Brandon Ingram, he will get a stat increase. And JJ Redick as well. Then we got Ben Simmons, dual ability. We already mentioned in our last video that there is an Onyx Joel and B. And we got Paul George, theme loyalty. You pair him up with two other players from this theme. And we got Kyrie Irving Sapphire, which can be crafted with three collectibles. He has team loyalty. So if we pair him up with Kevin Durant and James Harden, he'll get a boost. And we got James Harden as well, Sapphire. We got Julius Randle. Let's go next. He can be crafted with six collectibles. He is a Ruby player. We got Bradley Bill, Ruby as well, which can be crafted with five collectibles, 20 Ruby rings. He has team loyalty. We got Nikola Jokic, who has team loyalty. So if you pair him up with Michael Porter Jr. and Jamal Murray, he will get an increase. Or even the throwback Carmelo Anthony. Then we got Luka. He has team loyalty. Then we got a Ruby Steph Curry. My gosh, he was on fire yesterday. He has team loyalty. Pair him up with two other Warriors. We got Klay Thompson and Draymond Green. We got Jason Tatum with the Amethyst treatment. He has the dual ability with Jalen Brown. We got Damian Lillard with an Amethyst. Now, I was hoping he was getting an Onyx, but it's all good. Dame is buckets, man. He can be crafted. You need nine collectibles and 30 Amethyst rings. Team loyalty bonus in order to get his power increased. So you need to combine him for uh, CJ McCollum, uh, Clyde Drexler. Then we got Chris Paul Amethyst as well. He has team loyalty, so if you pair him up with Devin Booker and DeAndre Ayton. We got Anthony Davis, who has the dual ability with LeBron James. He can be crafted with 12 collectibles. And here goes another fire card, Kawhi Leonard, team loyalty. So if you pair him up with Paul George, Patrick Beverly, or any other clipper in the game, he will get an increase. And then we got Joel B, who has the dual ability, Onyx treatment, 24 collectibles to craft. Definitely worth investing in crafting because Joel B is one of the top centers in this game. Then we got a Giannis with the Onyx treatment. He has team loyalty bonus. So pair him up with Drew Holiday and Chris Middleton. He will get a bonus. Now, Giannis, I'm going to tell you right now. If 2K Mobile, if they do drop their all-star game MVP card like they did last year for Kawhi Leonard, then we could be seeing our first diamond player being Giannis. That's going to be insane. And usually those cards get prime player bonus, which means that diamond will be good even when pink diamond comes out. Then we got Onyx Kevin Durant with the prime player Billy I was just talking about. So this KD will hold you down even when the diamonds drop. 
I want this Kevin Durant, and I got some really good news for you, so definitely check in. And then we got LeBron James, who has the dual ability with Anthony Davis. So now we're going to go into the official announcements, the go over the event rewards, and it will go over the sets afterwards, so definitely stay tuned in. All right, so here goes the official announcement from NBA 2K Mobile. Definitely drop them a follow, and follow me as well. So we got all-star events. Bradley Bill is the Ruby reward in Fantasy Finals. Luca is the Ruby reward in Gauntlet. That's right, Gauntlet, right? It's coming back, our favorite event. So they're definitely showing a lot of love to the community. Now, this theme includes stat upgrades for Joel Embiid, Julius Randle, and more. So I will be dropping my stats breakdown video this week because I want to find out what players got stat upgrades and what their stats were before that. So one shooting stars collectible is in each event, including today's mini domination. So if you do get a chance to play the mini dom, it will make sense because you're going to get a collectible, which you need to make Kawhi. And I'm going to explain the sets after we break all this down. So as you see here, the fantasy final rewards are going to be Amethyst Jason Tatum and Onyx Joel and Bean. That's pretty incredible. And then the next event is going to be the gauntlet, which we explained earlier. But check out the rewards. Amethyst Anthony Davis and the Onyx Kevin Durant. Tell me that's not awesome. That is sick. I'm, I'm really excited and very happy with the rewards. And I, I just have to show the smiling KD, right? It's only right. KD's happy. I'm happy. We're, we're looking good. So now let's get into the sets. All right, so now there's two sets for this theme. Pretty awesome. Same thing happened last year, right? The last year, the reward was a Ruby Kemba Walker. This time around, the reward is an Amethyst. So that's pretty awesome. You can get a Amethyst Kawhi Leonard if you get two of the Shooting Star collectibles. And Shooting Star collectibles can be found in the store and All-Star events. Then we got the Gold Star collectibles, which you can get by training cards in the checklist. Then you got the Silver Star collectibles, which you can complete by, which you can get by completing the season halves objectives in the checklist. So grinding the checklist every day is going to get you coins along with collectibles that you need to make Kawhi Leonard. You need 10 of the gold stars and 10 of the silvers. Then you need 15 of the blue metal collectibles, which will be popping up on the draft board. So grind the seasons, grind head to head, try to get these draft picks. And then last but not least, you got the red metal collectibles, which are also dropping on the draft board. As you see, you get this Amethyst Kawhi Leonard, which is still very good to use. I'm still using Amethyst Kevin Durant from the winter theme. They still hold value. Now the next set, come on. You already see the player, Onyx LeBron James. How crazy is that? So you're going to get a chance to get a LeBron James, a Kevin Durant, and a Kawhi Leonard. The Three of the top small forwards in this game. So in order to get LeBron, though, you need to get Jalen Brown. You need to get Zach Levine. You need to get Sapphire Kyrie Irving. Ruby Bradley Bill, which they just announced is one of the rewards for the events. And then you need to craft Damian Lillard. That might be the tough one, right? Because you need 30 Amethyst rings. But the collectibles were a bit low. It wasn't too crazy. And you can get the Damian Lillard, which will be incredible for head-to-head. -head. And most importantly, if you get all these cards you'll be able to get this LeBron James. So it's going to be insane. I definitely hope everybody's ready to grind because the rewards are stacked. And this is one of the top themes this year. The fan favorites theme was incredible. So back-to-back -back fire themes. All right, so there's everything that you need to know for the new All-Star 2021 theme. If you're new to the game and you need more information, we've got tons of guys breaking down the events and ways to get better players in this game, check out the playlist. If you're into pack openings, then turn on your notifications because we got one dropping later in the week. And then we have a playlist full of those as well. And if you want to see gameplay for Michael Jordan, which was the last reward, uh, we also had fan favorite Stephen Curry, then check those out as well, all right? So again, appreciate all the support on the channel. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace out.